Hello all you bladers, for today's Speculation Saturday, it's gonna be what would my Beyblade journey be? This was a Q&A question from part one by Jayant Miner, but this question would take pretty long to answer, so instead of answering it in the Q&A part one, I'm gonna be answering it today and doing the Q&A part two tomorrow, which is Sunday. So, the story question I meant, would you complete in a national, would you compete in a national tournament and lose to a powerful bay? bay? and place to top four and move on to a sport team or something? Or would you upgrade your bay to like, for example, the bay of the season? So I guess he's talking about like, what would I do? Basically the basics, what would I be doing and everything? So would I compete in a national tournament? Probably, but not near the beginning. I feel like if I was like a main character in the anime, I would like be a kind of noob blader, kind of like, not really like Vault, because obviously I know like the basics of launching and everything, but I feel like I would be like, kind of like drum, kind of like, not really enthusiastic or like, we, like, uh, like looking up to a certain blader. I feel like I would just be like, kind of like nobody really knows who I am. And like, I guess I'm just a normal blader, but I don't really, know that much about like base spirits or like super powerful launches or anything just the basics so i feel like i would i feel like i would be a student in the bay goma academy bay club just because i feel like that's like i just feel like i would be a school student since i am a school student right now i wouldn't be eager because i don't really like live on a farm obviously dante i don't really know I, I feel like dante is like just all around living in different places so i don't really I feel like I would be in the Baygoma Academy Bay Club. Um, I also like, depending on what time period, I'm saying, let's say I'm a main character in the dual layer. I'm just gonna base this off of if I'm a main character in the dual layer era. So I feel like I would kind of like see Vault and like his squad and be like kind of jealous and maybe I would form my like own squad with like, maybe like I'd be friends with like, I don't know, um, maybe like, Ken or so? I don't know. I feel like I would compete in a national tournament after I like learned the skills of blading. It's like, it's if you're a main character, you have to go through like the basics of like training and meeting your squad and everything. Vault, basically he made friends wherever he went. He was battling people and turned them into rivals basically. Iger, his story, I guess he just met a bunch of people and they became friends with him. Dante, pretty much his only friends were Fumia and, no, not Fumia, um, Armin and da Delta. And then he basically, whoever opponent he beat, I guess they just wanted to be his friend. I, I, I don't know. I think like I would be closer to maybe Hoji or I don't know, it's hard to explain with the characters, but would I compete in a national tournament and lose to a powerful bay? I would definitely lose to a powerful bay. I would probably not place top four because it, it would be my first national tournament and a national tournament is a big thing because that means you were high in the rankings of the individual tournaments or like the, uh, the, the basic tournaments, I guess, because the national tournament in the dual layer is where Louis Shirasagi was in that tournament, but before that was the individual matches. I, I guess like it's it's a tournament still, but it's like less less intense. So I, I would have to like make it through that first phase tournament to make it to the international nationals nationals. So I feel like I would maybe place top eight. Maybe it's it's I really don't know what to say for my Beyblade story. Um, would I place top four? Probably not. I would probably be in the top eight, like I said, because I don't, I feel like that would be my first national tournament. Obviously, because I'm the main character, they would obviously like improve my story and like make it so I'm powerful, but I don't know if I would move on a sport team or something. Move on a sport team. I think you mean like, would I be on BC Solar Raging Bulls or something? I feel like I would probably be on like a different team like maybe like el astro or something no not, that's not a team that's i feel like i would um, i don't know like would you upgrade your bay to like for example the bay of the season i don't know the overall question of what would your, what would your journey be is a really it's a, it's a really interesting question i just don't know how to answer it because it's like very specific so 
I'm in the dual layer era. I feel like I would be friends with Hoji in the Bagoma Academy Bay Club. I would learn the basics of blading, compete in a national tournament after getting in the first phase, getting through the first phase of the first tournament, maybe place top eight. Um, I would probably choose the, what, what team is that? I would probably choose to go to BC Seoul. They might not accept me, they might, I don't know. I mean, Vault seems like he'd accept anyone, but at the same time, Chris is the ruler, Chris is the owner and she only accepts powerful bladers. So you have to be decently powerful to go there in, in the first place. So I don't think maybe, I, I think they maybe wouldn't accept me in BC Seoul. Maybe I would join Xander's team. Um, um, would you upgrade your bay to like, for example, the bay of the season? I don't know what you mean by that. Do you mean, would you upgrade your bay to like, for example, the bay of the season? Bay of the, I don't get what that question means. The bay of the, do you mean like, would I upgrade my bay to like Achilles or Valtriac or Dragon or Hyperion or Helios or Belial? Those are all the main characters' bays, like the bay of the season. I don't. I don't know, like, it's, I don't know how to answer that. Um, mm, okay, I'm just very confused right now, and I think I gave the basics, I answered the questions, like, okay, I would up, would I upgrade my bay to like, for example, the bay of the season? Um, probably. Like, my bay would definitely break, because that's a phase that happens with all the main characters. Vault's bay breaks. He gets the Strike God Valkyrie chip and the Ultimate Reboot Driver. Achilles breaks. He gets Chosy Achilles. Dragon breaks. Imperial Dragon. Helios and Hyperion breaks. He gets the Limit breaks. Um, and then Belial will probably break after getting all the upgrades. And then he'll, like, find, probably, like, find some way to, like, make an evolution of a bay that'll combine all those parts together, but... I don't know, like, what would your Beyblade journey be is a very cool question, but it's also very specific, and I don't really, I, I just, like, woke up this morning, and, um, I don't really, like, I just decided I would do this right now, because it is Saturday today, so, like, I, I kind of, like, I forgot to do this, because I, um, I forgot to do this question for Speculation Saturday, so I'm doing it, like, on the morning of the day it's uploaded, so I don't really, like, I haven't really thought about it too much, but I think this is where I'm gonna end it off. Sorry if I couldn't answer like anything more specific, but I do, I feel like I answered the questions that you said, like, would you compete in a national tournament, lose to a powerful bay, place top four, move on to a sport team, would you upgrade your bay? So I feel like I answered all the basic questions. Sorry about that. Q and A part two will be out tomorrow. If you have any questions for Q and A part two, um, then, that you haven't already put in. Like if you have any questions for Q&A part two that you didn't already comment, then put them in the comments for this video. Um, I'll do it tomorrow. And then yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Subscribe if you enjoyed, have fun, peace out. Sorry if I didn't answer anything specific, Giant Miner. And don't forget to keep on blading.